Republican leaders in the House and Senate are upping the ante in the battle with the governor regarding ongoing COVID-19 restrictions in the state. Yesterday, Senate Majority Leader Paul Gazelka and House Minority Leader Kurt Doubt held a press conference at the Capitol to announce what they are calling a contract to open up Minnesota. They say that if the Senate remains in Republican control and if the House switches to Republican control and they're able to end the governor's emergency powers, they will enact five key promises in this contract. Those promises include reopening all Minnesota schools, allowing all school athletics and activities to safely resume, allowing local schools to determine how many fans can attend games, allowing all houses of worship to reopen, and ending the one-size-fits-all restrictions on bars and restaurants. We now trust Minnesotans to look at the data, look at the science, follow the CDC guidelines, and live their lives in all of these different areas. DFL Party Chairman Ken Martin responded to that Republican contract by saying, quote, the Republican Party's plan is entirely to ignore COVID-19, and that is going to get people killed. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.